for all you vloggers, podcasters, self-broadcasters out there. I have an incredibly quick video, but like, quite frankly, can save a marriage. It will save you and your audiences so much time, okay, in editing video and audio podcast files, okay? This is how we let the machines finally do the editing work. So first thing I'm gonna do is select my audio and video file, desktop, make video external. This is just a mock file. What it's gonna do, it's gonna strip out the audio. Very soon, the final feature we're gonna have is compression where I'm actually gonna be able to, instead of delete silence, I'm gonna be able to like, compress it all down. So check this out. You don't have to do a thing, okay? What happens is this pulls up, this is a video file. Um, it automatically strips out the audio to show you, to give you the visual cues to see what you're gonna delete and what you're not. Its original length um, was over a minute and a half. This is gonna be able to shorten this file by 30 seconds, okay? Um, and it shows you the processing time. And what you see right here is an actual preview. So right here is where your silences are actually happen. And it shows the filter below, which does automatic recommendation levels based upon the math. Um, we we can remove silences shorter than longer than so you can see um, right now is 0.5 seconds um, we can update the silent selection we'll show you exactly how long the new file will be shortened to so you can specify the minimum duration of silence that you want to leave alone so if you want to leave a little breathing room between there 0.5 seconds is fantastic and so this magic button right here add grace period it just adds a little bit of extra time to the front end of that audio file so that you can make sure that you're um, uh, leaving the entire word intact. And before you actually process this file, and we do native MOV, um, um, all the family and the FFmpeg, so I mean literally you can capture direct on your phone or on your computer and use this as a preprocessor to completely trim the fat before you go live. So this actually shows you what the output file is gonna be before you process it. I'll let you take a listen. And it's my voice again, not to be confusing. No matter if you're an engineer or in sales, at some point, you're going to want to share video external. To do that, you make a playlist, right? You go to my content, select your videos, click create new playlist. I'm going to label mine external playlist, click view. Now you want to go in and edit descriptions and the permissions. So you'll add a description. What I did was I just saved 30 seconds on a minute long video file. Um, when you're talking about lag in webinars, when you're talking about time to think, um, you know, pauses in between sentences, literally you can go in and trim the fat before you go. So this is all essentially done. I can alter these filter levels below, but I don't need to because we use great math and great algorithms to do it. So all I'm gonna do is hit start processing audio and, and video file. And literally on an hour long show, if, this, if you were to do this by hand, it would take you four to five hours. This is something you're going to be able to snap together and do together in five minutes. You hit run, go get a sandwich, go pick up the kids, go to soccer practice, do something else, go spend it with the family because this is just gonna run in the background and what is output is going to be a beautiful finished video or audio podcast.